Hi, my name is Jared Blakely. I'm from San Antonio, Texas. I weigh 295 pounds and I'm totally blind. Um, this right here is my guide dog Seymour. He goes everywhere with me. Um, I try to live a, as active a life as I can. I get out there. I've got two college degrees. Um, currently unemployed right now, but still looking for a job. One of the ways I think uh, Biggest Loser can really help me out is by having me lose this weight so when I do go on a job interview, I don't show up covered in sweat. You see, I have to walk everywhere I go, and in this hot Texas heat, it's, uh, it can be pretty brutal. So, losing the weight would uh, help me become a, a bit more financially independent. Um, Seymour, uh, he's my best friend, and I also need to lose weight so that I can feel uh, just uh, happy and confident taking him out. I mean, I'm confident he'll never, you know, lead me wrong, but, you know, halfway down the block, I start, you know, running out of breath, and on two blocks in, I'm huffing and puffing. So, a lot of times, I tend to stay inside or ride somewhere in the car instead of getting this guy the exercise he really needs, and <laughs> that I need for that matter. Um, again, Seymour is a real important part of my life. Um, he's saved my life before. Uh, I was going to walk into the street and right into an oncoming car, and he stopped me. So if it wasn't for Seymour, I don't think I'd be here. And I want to stay here, and that's why I really need Biggest Loser. I've seen how you've changed other people's lives, and I need that. My father died at 42. I'm only 30. I'm 32 now, and I want 10. I don't want just 10 years of life. I need more than that to get all that I want to accomplish done. Um, right now, I'm single. Again, with uh, being totally blind, uh, it's kind of hard to meet somebody. It's like a strike against you. And then being overweight as well is strike two. Um, so I feel if I lost some weight, I would feel better about going out and, and dancing. I love to dance, but I, after one or two dances, I'm sweating all over my partner. And, she, you know, that's never pleasant for anybody. And I want to be able to, to dance without, you know, smelling like sweat. Um, I want to get out there. I want to have you know, more fun like I used to. I used to do martial arts. I used to be an equestrian. Um, I, but after I lost my eyesight, I sort of slowed down on a few of those active things and worked more on my education. And the uh, weight just started to... Uh, snowball. First it was like only 5, 10, 20 pounds and now it's up to, you know, 90, 100 pounds overweight. So I'm really asking, um, Biggest Loser, please help me save my life. Help me make a, a better life for, for my dog, my best friend. Thank you. Hi, I'm here at my favorite uh, Mexican food restaurant. It's um, really good and it's uh, high praise because in San Antonio we have the best Mexican food. And I'm going to enjoy some fresh tortilla chips and fresh salsa right now. So what do you have ordered today, Jared? I've got my beef fajita platter coming, and uh, my margarita is already right here. And um, this is pretty much a basic, uh, a good sample you know, of what I like to eat. Flour tortillas and, and beef and beans and rice and salsa.
you can talk to me while I'm doing it. Oh yeah. Yeah. You so what? What are you? What are you loading it up there I'm with, Jared? Putting uh, refried beans in here. Uh huh. And what and else? I'm gonna put some rice along there with it, and some pico de gallo. Pretty sure I cut it in there. Maybe. Uh. And some meat. Don't forget the jalapenos. Yeah, they jalapenos. have the. What is it that they have, Darren? Uh, it's supposed to help your metabolism? Capsation? <laughs> Cap capstan? Or capsation. Capsation? But, uh, yeah. but anyway, there's something about peppers that are supposed to help your metabolism, right? Sure. <laughs> but that's not why you eat them. <laughs> you eat them because you like the flavor? I eat them because I like the flavor. And right there is what I would consider a properly made, uh, well-loaded chicken or beef fajita. And now I'm going to eat it. And your guide dog's here with you? Mm-hmm. Seymour is under the table. Being oh, a good boy. There he is, minding his own business in the restaurant. Yes, he doesn't get any uh, people food ever. But uh, he definitely goes everywhere I go. Uh huh. So, how often do you come to this place to eat? Oh, your mother taught you not to talk with your mouth full, I see. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good thing. <laughs> as often as I can. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So you really want to change your life and give up things like this? Well, it's a trade-off, but yeah, I kind of do. I do. It'd be nice if you could lose weight and not give up all this. Mm -hmm. But if you have to give up all this, and it means that you would uh, lose the weight and be able to change your life, what do you think? Uh, I've, I guess I would have to. I'm, I'm hoping that... Um, because loser can show me ways to have tasty food that's not uh, that's healthy. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, Lower in calories. So, so, so far, I have not met much say, uh, you know healthy food that's uh, tasty. So okay. That's what I'm... Thank you. <sighs> well, um, that was excellent lunch. I, I think I'm about done. So. Uh... Mm. really good. We don't want to leave any. Oh, nope, it's the one. So how was that, Jared? Oh, that was delicious. And you're full, right? Yes. Yes, I'm full. You're full. I mean, would yeah, you I'm Would full. you eat dessert right now? Uh, well, I mean, I could make myself eat dessert right now. No. I don't, <laughs> want, you, I don't want you to do that. And usually you wouldn't. You're not... Not usually too bad no, about I mean, I, that was a pretty big plate of food. Um, I mean, I can see myself snacking on something in a few hours or something that I might do. Something sweet? Yeah, something sweet. Uh, okay. And I'm going to walk to my corner store. Um, this is kind of where I get um, all my snack foods. And uh, it's a very convenient um, because it's close, but it's kind of inconvenient because it's full of all the bad food that I love. Also, you get to see Seymour with me and he'll do his thing for you. Come on, Seymour. Come here.
and she was dehydrated, covered in ticks, had no one to see her walks back inside. Tough to do. Okay, so a few more facts about me. I am a huge nerd. Um, I love all things nerdy, comic books, Dungeons and Dragons, World of Warcraft, and yes, I found a way to play World of Warcraft even though I can't see. I love to cook, um, although I don't really enjoy cleaning. I um, really looking forward to seeing everyone in Dallas and going all the way with Biggest Loser. I feel like you guys are my only chance, uh, my last chance. I really need to lose this weight and I'm willing to do anything. I'm very dedicated. Um, I'll give you the, the most of anyone has ever given before on the show, I swear. Um, so please pick me. See you in Dallas. Uh, looking forward to it.